Now, there'll be some interesting battles between Wisconsin and Minnesota. No doubt this year, of course, the Gophers, the other team making the transition from the WCHA into the Big Ten. And when we talk about Minnesota's outlook, Don Lucia has a ton of talent back as well. Kyle Rao, Nate Condon, and Adam Wilcox, who arguably was the best freshman goaltender in the nation a year ago. Sure, they lose guys like Howla, Bugstad, and Nate Schmidt. But as we heard in those quotes, Minnesota is Minnesota. A lot's expected of the Gophers. And I think Don Lucia expects a lot this year, Fred, especially when you have a returning goaltender like Adam Wilcox. Well, no question. Uh, Adam Wilcox, when you talk to John Lucia, he says, he's my clear-cut consensus number one guy. And there's nobody else like that starting out in the Big Ten. There's competition everywhere else. Uh, in Don's words, it's like, why start the backup quarterback when you've got your number one guy uh, ready to go? And Adam Wilcox, you know, just took the bull by the horns last season, uh, finished with 25 victories to tie a Minnesota record, uh, played the last 37 games, was their playoff MVP. And you got to love a goalie who can solve a Rubik's Cube in less than a minute. Maybe a little too smart for his own good. Goaltenders sometimes just read and react instead. Plenty of reaction from Kyle Rao. He's an emotional guy, a guy that gets pretty fired up. But along with Nate Condon, there are two guys that, as team captains, not only lead, but also put the puck in the net. Well, there'll be some pressure on the two co-captains, uh, Nate Condon and Kyle Rao, to start the season. Uh, with Condon, great speed, finished the second half with 10 of his 12 goals. And Kyle Rao, to me, kind of embodies what hockey in Minnesota is all about. Uh, his brother played in the NHL. Uh, he was uh, Mr. Hockey Minnesota the best player in high school and he's always been the go-to guy for his team tremendous tenacity for Kyle Rao and uh, he makes the move from wing to center going to put a little more defensive responsibility on him this season and I know there's another guy you're keeping an eye on in Minneapolis Mr. Camerata who is diminutive in size but certainly not in his skill well Kyle Rao is 5'8 175 uh, Tyler Camerata is Five foot seven, 154 pounds. Do you know how good you have to be to get drafted in the third round of the NHL draft by the New York Islanders when you're 5'7", 154? This guy put up eye-popping numbers in the USHL with Waterloo. 93 points. He was the USHL Player of the Year. I can't wait to see this kid go. His coach from junior said he's always two steps ahead of everybody else on the ice.